Hey, this is Presh Talwalkar. Happy 2018. To celebrate the new year, I want to share a math trick that got really popular and even got coverage in places like the Telegraph. Follow the directions carefully and do the calculations in sequence. Use a calculator to check your work and press the equal sign after each step. The trick works only in the year 2018. Get started with your shoe size. Round down to the nearest whole number. We don't want any half sizes. Now multiply by 5. Then add 50. Then multiply by 20. Add 1,017. If you have already had your birthday this year, add one more. Otherwise, do nothing. Finally, subtract the year that you were born. The answer will be your shoe size followed by your age. Amazing! Please share if this effect worked for you. The more interesting question mathematically is why does it work? Can you figure out the algebra? Give it a try and when you're ready keep watching for my explanation. So let's go through each step. We start with your shoe size, which I'll denote by the variable s. We multiply by 5 to get 5s. Then we add 50, which results in 5s plus 50. Now we need to multiply by 20, so we take the entire term 5s plus 50 and multiply it by 20. The 20 will distribute to each of these terms, so we end up with 100s plus 1000. Now we add 1017 to get 100s plus 2017. If you have already had your birthday this year, add one more, which would result in 100s plus 2018. we finally need to subtract the year that you were born. So there are two cases. If you have not had your birthday this year, this will be 100s plus 2017 minus the year that you were born. And since you have not had your birthday already, 2017 minus the year that you were born will be your age. So we end up with 100s plus your age. If you have had your birthday, then when you take 100s plus 2018 minus the year that you were born, 2018 minus the year that you were born will be your age. So this will be 100s plus your age. So the variable s has been shifted over two decimal places, and then the remaining two will be your age, a two-digit number. So that's why the answer will be your shoe size followed by your age. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I make videos on math. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions. If you like this video, you can check out my books, which are listed in the video description. You can support me on Patreon, and you can also catch me on social media, either at Mind Your Decisions or at Presh Tallwalker.